Hello everyone, this is Totally Random, back here with another video. So, in today, this article from ESPN, it says, Pat Shermer named head coach of the Giants. Pat Shermer was the offensive coordinator for the, for the Minnesota Vikings this past season. So let's read the article. The New York Giants hired Minnesota Vikings offensive coordinator Pat Shermer as the 18th head coach in Giants history on Monday afternoon. Shermer has a strong history of working with and developing quarterbacks. He succeeds Ben McDew, who was fired last month with the four games remaining in a 3-13 season. A source told ESPN's Adam Schefter that Shermer received a five-year contract. The former Cleveland Browns head coach became available after the Vikings were shell shell-lacked 38-7 in the NFC Championship game on Sunday night in Philadelphia. Shermer opted after the game to avoid talking about talking much about his future, saying there was another time and place for that. I want to thank uh, John Mara and Steve Tisch for giving me the opportunity to be the head coach of the New York Giants, Shermer said in a news release. I'm looking forward, I'm looking forward to getting to work with general manager Dave Gentleman and assistant GM Kevin Abrams and starting the process to once build a championship team. I've been fortunate to work with many great coaches and players, and I am thankful for those relationships. I would like to thank my family and friends for their tremendous support. I can't wait to start working with it, Pat Gentleman said in the release. I know he will provide the type of leadership we need to take our team back to where it belongs. I have followed Pat's career for many years, and he has had great success wherever he has been. What struck me during our conversation is that being made the head coach of the New York Giants is not too big for him. He's made for this, this moment and this opportunity. Shermer takes over a Giants team that has the number two overall pick in this year's draft and could be in the market for a quarterback with Eli Manning turning 37 earlier this month. Early indications from the team and more gentlemen that the Giants will retain Manning for at least one more season and he will have a chance to work with Shermer. The Giants chose Shermer after interviewing six candidates, New England Patriots offensive coordinator Josh McDaniels and defensive coordinator Matt Patricia, Carolina Panthers defensive coordinator Steve Wilkes, and interim Giants coach and defensive coordinator Steve Spagnuolo, and def former Denver Broncos running backs coach Eric Studsville were also interviewed. After Patricia chose the Detroit Lions, the domino started to fall. McDaniels is expected to land with the Indianapolis Colts, and Shermer became the target of the Giants. Shermer also interviewed with the Arizona Cardinals, Lions, and Chicago Bears. A source told ESPN last week that he wanted the Giants job. Shermer uh, was a longtime assistant with the Eagles under Andy Reid before becoming the offensive coordinator for the Rams under Spagnuolo. He then was the head coach of the Browns for two seasons where he amassed a 9-23 mark. He later returned to Philadelphia as Chip Kelly's offensive coordinator before landing with the Vikings. After the McDew era crashed in ugly fashion in its second season, the Giants were looking for a coach who had either been a head coach or had significant experience as a coordinator. Shermer has both. He is eyeing former Oakland Raiders coach Dak Del Rio to be his defense coordinator, sources recently told ESPN's Chris Mortensen. One source who worked with Shermer called him a really smart offensive coach whose players love playing for him. His track record of success with quarterbacks in recent years is is among his most impressive accomplishments. Shermer has gotten career years out of Nick Foles, Sam Bradford, and most recently Case Keenum. The Vikings tr players raved about, how, raved about him as a coach and person. He's one of the best coaches I've played for, Vikings tight end Kyle Rudolph said. He's a guy I had the pleasure of working with in the tight end room before he took over as offensive coordinator halfway through the year, and then working with him day in and day out the way he's led the offense and took us. Even though we faced the adversity of losing another starting quarterback, another starting running back, he carried us all the way to a top 10 offense. I don't want to read through the whole thing, but you get to see the thing. Pat Shermer named the head coach for the Giants. If you I think this is a good hire... Or if you don't, comment below and tell me what you think. I don't know yet. I'm not sure yet. I'm never sold. Usually on I've on guys with like one good season, but I, um, as an offensive coordinator here. But that's for y'all to decide. So comment below and tell me what you think if this is a good hire or not. Um, most importantly, subscribe. We're trying to get to 20 subscribers by the end of the week. That is the goal. So please hit the subscribe button right now, and um, like this video and share this video and. Um, I'll get back to you with another video soon, so peace out.